Hello, happy Tuesday, everyone. And I know it's supposed to be t shirt and diaper Tuesday, but not at my house. It's too cold for t shirts and diapers. I'm telling you, it is cold. I want to show you the temperature before I show you her outfit. Look at this 59 degrees. That's cold. I know some of you are probably saying, sure, it's not that cold. Over here, it's colder. Well, for California, that's cold. We're not used to those cold temperatures. So anyways, I bundled Skylar up because her vinyl was so cold when I went to change her. And I put this blanket on her, and it is a white blanket with, with, um, with gray, brown, and yellow spot polka dots on it. Very warm blanket. And in her PJs is a camouflage PJs. And I know they're supposed to be boys, but um, preemie stuff is so hard to find in the store. I was surprised I found this at Walmart, and it was, and it was only like, I think, four bucks, which isn't bad for a preemie outfit or pajamas. So um, we got it for her. And she's wearing this green and white striped hat because we didn't have anything to match her PJs. And she has on her bird mittens to keep her hands warm. So she's sitting there all pretty snuggled right here, nice and warm. And I wanted to um, do a tag that Pam's life had going on the other day. I don't know who started it. She did say, but I totally forgot who she said started it. But it is called the accent tag. And the first question is, what is it called when the toilet, toilet, when you, sorry, my mouth. What is it called when you toilet paper a house? Um, it's called TP'd. I remember um, when I was in school and we used to TP someone's house. Usually it's like if your team loses in football or something and, or maybe somebody you don't like and you just go over there and you wrap the toilet paper all around the tree sometimes. You might take an egg and throw it at the house, too. Okay. What is the bug that that when you touch it, it curls into a ball? It's a roly-poly. We used to play with those all the time when we were kids. What is the bubbly carbonated drink called? Um, either soda or Coke. What do you call gym shoes? Tennis shoes. What do you say to address a group of people? Now, if I'm in the front and I'm going to talk to a group of people, I probably would say ladies and gentlemen. But if I'm walking up to a group of people, then I might say, hey guys, or what's going on everybody? Um, what do you call the kind of spider or spider-like creature that has an oval-shaped body and extremely long legs? That sounds like a daddy long legs. What do you call your grandparents? We called our grandparents grandma and grandpa. What do you, what do you call the wheeled contraption in which you, you carry your groceries at the supermarket? Wheeled contraption. <laughs> um, that would be a grocery cart. What do you call it when the rain falls while the sun is shining? That would be a sun shower. What is the thing you changed the TV channel with? A remote. And I still change my TV channel with it. What would, what would it be without that remote? I remember as a kid when my grandmother would say, Lori, go change the channel. And I'd have to change the channel. And then you sit down a few minutes later. Hey. Go change the channel to channel 5. And you'd have to get up and go change it again. Why didn't they get up and change it? No, they'd always send the kids to get up and change the channel. Oh, we were so happy when there was a remote. No more getting up to change the channel. No, but then, then instead of getting up to change the channel, it's like, hey, where is the remote? Who had the remote last? And everybody's going, I don't know. And then you got to look around the house till you find the thing. And if you don't find it, everybody's, Going crazy because they, they don't seem to know how to turn that TV on without the remote anymore. Good times. Anyways. <laughs>
Anyways, here's Skyler still laying here looking up at the ceiling. Hey, Skyler, are you warm now? She looks really toasty to me. And I guess that's all the tag. And I'm going to add my end. I swear I cannot talk today. I think I should go back and learn how to talk again. I'm going to end my video now before it gets to be a long book. And I will talk to you next time. God bless and goodbye.